the bikes are in place. I'm ready to go. And the riders have been preparing a long time to take on a 175 mile course. It's been, uh, you know, afternoons and weekdays of uh, weekends of, of riding. With start time approaching, participants are checking their bikes, getting their muscles loose, and fueling up. I got my cheese and bean burrito and my muffins and getting ready to go. They seem determined to go and support a cause important to them. This is the Lone Star Ride Fighting AIDS, hosted for the first time in Irving at Microsoft. AIDS affects everyone. Uh, it knows no demographic boundary from children to old people. And we wanted to be part of the solution. Microsoft and the city of Irving have been super to us. We couldn't ask for better partners and better sponsors. They are fantastic. They are supporting our cause and uh, ride tremendously. The city of Irving's been amazing. When we made the choice to partner with the city of Irving last year, we were looking for a new home. Just the general atmosphere was so full service compared to other cities. Um, they helped a struggling little ride like us that doesn't have a lot of resources to bring in a lot of professional services. They were there. It's just a great event and something we could all uh, give back to the community. Many of these riders choose this cause for a reason. I have a lot of friends who are impacted by the disease, so I feel like Someday they might need the services of the chair, the organizations that we give the money back to, so that's why I ride. For others, the reason is even more personal. Ari Prince is riding for the first time this year. I am positive, so. And this is the first time I'm saying that in front of you actually, so that's something new. He is sharing his story because he says it is all positive so far and he wants to support the charities that are now supporting him. It doesn't stop me from doing anything I want to do. So. That upbeat outlook is reflected in the organization's activities. The ride includes a lot of social events. People affected by the disease and those who want to offer support have fun events throughout the weekend and year. You have to keep a sense of humor, uh, both about yourself and your challenges that you face. That's how you manage your disease, being an openly HIV positive person, um, humor and Humor along with seriousness is how you get through and manage your disease. They all kept that sense of humor, even when it became clear that the weather would not cooperate. We can ride around the parking lot, because there's it's covered. <laughs> what started as a delay became a total rain out on day one. Safety is our first concern. Even if we can't ride, we're still gonna have a good time just hanging out together. This is the team called Anything Goes. We actually met last year on the ride, all of us. Okay, we decided to form a team, and so we are, right now, we are number three in fundraising. They are happy to know they are among those making a difference. That fundraising, along with medical research, has led to longer and better lives for people with HIV and AIDS. To know that we did those kinds of things, rain is nothing. <laughs>